the reviews came out a lot faster than the critics leave in an admission. <laughs> By the end of Funny Boy, Max Bialystok's hopeless musical of Hamlet, everybody is dead. <laughs> they were the lucky ones. <laughs> Oh, and this is the best review we got. God, where did I go wrong? What happened to me? What happened to me? You're looking at the man who... You're looking at the man who used to have the biggest name on Broadway. Max B.I. stock. Thirteen letters. <laughs> I used to be the king, the king of all Broadway, the best of everything was mine to have. My shoulder was at the biggest. I never was the biggest. <laughs>
no government of the fight again. Spirits I as fight again, I'll never shut the slight again, I'll take the sweet the right again. No matter what I'll fight again, no possible in the fight again, no fight if it's all right to me. Bye-bye, my little powder pigeon. Bye-bye. Oh, 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 o
I like Papa, but I'm not going to talk about Papa. The dirty old buzzer. No, no, Mr. Gelsen. Yeah. Sure. I'm terribly sorry I caught you feeling up that old lady. Feeling up that old lady. Thank you, Mr. Pat. May I take your coat? Thank you. Oh. So, you're an accountant, huh? Yes, I am. You're an account for yourself. No. Do you believe in God? Do you believe in home? Why are you going to put old lady's dresses? A bit of a pervert, huh? No. I know what you're all thinking. How dare you condemn me without knowing all the facts? I'm not condemning Shut up! I'm having a rhetorical conversation! <laughs> Do you know who I used to be? Yes! Yes, you're Max Bialystok, the king of broad. No! I'm Max Bialystok, the king of old. That's right. <laughs> That's right. May I just say, Mr. Bialystok, I hope you don't think this is the wrong thing, but you're not just a dirty old man. Thank you. That was a great wrong way to do so. And there's something about me you should know. When I was a boy, I had the good fortune to be taken to the alley of 1942. And I still have the ticket stub. And ever since, I had a desire to be a Broadway pre... A Broadway pre... A Broadway pre... Producer? Yes, sir! <laughs> a secret desire, huh? Yes. Oh, hey kid, can I give you a little advice? Keep it a secret. <laughs> to the books. Eh? Yes. To the books. Yes. Yes. Oh, oh, just look at that. That's a great blonde. Stepping out of a white Rolls Royce limo. That's it, baby! When you got it, flaunt it! Flaunt it! <laughs>
Frank, how's it in? How's this? <laughs>
can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Me and you. Oh, we can do it. We can do it. We can make our dreams come true. Everything you've ever wanted is just waiting to be had. Beautiful girls wearing nothing but pearls, caressing you, undressing you, and driving you mad. We can do it. We can do it. Oh, this is not the time to shirk. Goodbye to Van Clerk. Hi, producer. Yes, producer. I mean you, sir. Go berserk. Oh, we can do it. Oh, we can do it. And I know it's gonna work. What do you say? What do I say? Find a chance to be a Broadway producer. Yes, Mr. Fox. You! You've got me, Nash! You've never seen 
seen someone humiliated before. Get back to work. All of you. <laughs>
What am I doing here? Mr. Bielostov was right. There is a lot more to me than there is to me. Stop the world! I want to get on! What the hell is going on over here? Do I smell the revolting stench of self-esteem? <laughs> Boom! What do you think you're coming? You party had your toilet break. I'm not going into the toilet. I'm going into show business. And I got news for you. I quit. Furthermore, you are a CPA, a certified public asshole. Spring 
the time for Hitler. <laughs> a gay romp with Adolf and Eva at Berchtesgarten. <laughs> A love letter to Hitler. <laughs> a week. A week? Are you kidding? This one has got to close on page four. Listen, uh, what's, what's the author's name? Uh, Franz Liebkin, 61 Jane Street, New York, New York. Franz Liebkin, 61 Jane Street. Jane Street, Jane Street. That's off Broadway. I hate off Broadway. <laughs> right. Experimental theater. No parking. It's a jungle down there. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> we'll get the Broadway right to springtime for Hitler, even if we have to go so far as to pay him. Oh, Max, this other hat, may I wear it? Ooh, no, you may not. Well, why not? Because that, that is a Broadway producer's hat, and you do not get to wear a Broadway producer's hat until you are a Broadway producer, and you are not a Broadway producer. I know, producer. I know, until I produce the show on Broadway. But I tell you, I'm going to wear that hat, and soon, too, cuz we're going to be the producer. Yes, we're heading to the top. We're going to be the producer. Lights, 
music, happy tippy tappy toes, or you know, not many people know this, but the fear was a terrific dance. Now we know that they did it. That's not it. That's a B, B, C. This is British lies! But they never said a bad thing about Winston Churchill, did they?
You will raise your right forefingers <laughs> and repeat after me. I solemnly swear, I solemnly swear to obey the sacred Siegfried Oss. To obey the sacred Siegfried Oss. And, and, and. <laughs> Alone. 
these things. That's why we're here. This guy couldn't direct you to the bathroom.
resurrected? Never there. We're in the business. And what a business. In the same day, I am taking the Siegfriedo and dancing the Congo with a cop, a sailor, a very friendly Cherokee. Yes. <laughs> we said, let's smoke a peace pipe. I knew it was time to go. <laughs> but, together we'll make it. Partners, we are. Partners all the way. Nothing and no one will ever come between us. Nothing or no one, Max. Come in!
teach you everything? There's always a part of the show for the producer's girlfriend. Well, Max, we don't even know when we're starting rehearsal. So what? Until she goes into the show, she can work for us here yeah, because we need men. They serve to have ourselves a gorgeous speed. Secretary slash receptionist. Max, a secretary who doesn't speak English. What will people say? They'll say, ooh, ooh, Yeah. <laughs> 
with any creature sporting silk or lace. I was firmly headed in the right direction when suddenly I stumbled on Oops. that face. That face, that face, that dangerous face. I must be unwise. Those lips, that nose.
call you back. That face, that face, that glorious face, this girl is truly blessed. Ooh, we wow, wow. Deutsche Bank 
mit ping, mit boom, mit ping, bang, ping, bang, boom.
Hi, intro. I just wish everyone good luck. <laughs> Give it up! You're going out there, screaming, hysterical, 
myself. <laughs>
of bridges. It is so true. And I loved every minute of it. No way out. How could this happen? The show was lousy fun. We did everything wrong. Where did we go right? <laughs> Christmas came early in Broadway this season, and guess who they stuffed in our stocking? Adolf Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> it was so crass and so crude. Even Goebbels would have booed. <laughs> Where did we go right? Tonight, a new star was born on Broadway. The lovely Miss Ulla Inka Hansen Benson Yarn Carlin Carlin Spartan Oh, fast. We predict that her name will soon be up in lights if they can find enough balls. We search Broadway on and on with singers with a cough. We had prior to not be shooting by the score. And a triple like fantastic weekend dances to a spastic. If anyone should take, we should take them out the door. They shouted her name. Well, that sounds like on display. Where did we go right? Our leading man was so gay, he nearly flew away. Is a theatrical genius. Now they like me. <laughs> oh, we knew we couldn't lose. Have the audience with you. <laughs> <laughs> it's the end of our careers. Been a month for twenty years.
<laughs> now I can't jump me out of Stockton's bloom. Say your prayers. You know what I said I'd tell you? I'm going too deep. Yeah? We're in too deep. I'll be the van. Go to Rio. Yeah. What a 
man without a conscience. There was no one who gave a damn about it. And that, Your Honor, is what hurts the most. I thought I'd last found a loyal partner, a man I cared about, and who I thought cared about me. But now when I need him most, he's deserted. And I will probably never see or hear from him ever again. Well, that's not true. Who are you? I'm Leopold Bloom, Max Bialystok's partner, the rat who deserted his sinking ship. I see. And uh, who are you, my name? My name is Lula Inga Hunting Benton Johnson, Talon Harlem's father sponsored. Lou. Lou? Your. his wife? Yeah, Your Honor. He wouldn't do it unless we have married. <laughs> Your Honor, this was all my scheme. Here's the money that we stole. My hotel, airfare. A large jar of cocoa butter. <laughs> Bailiff, Mark Paddock's in today. Now, Mr. Bloom, why in the world would you come back and give yourself up? To speak of his Now, we all know that Max Piazza is a lying, cheating, double crossing, underhanded, backstabbing, sliding. And Don't help me. <laughs> Yes. I'm sorry, I called you a fat, fat, fat. Thank you. <laughs> Your Honor, if I may address the court. Now, as far as I understand it, the law was created to protect people from being wrong. So, who has Max Biela stopped wrong? Not these dear ladies.
shysters in the past. Now I'm well adjusted, cause I've got this friend at last. Don't help me. <laughs> Always playing singles, never double. Never had a pal to share my troubles till